Hello, welcome boys and girls. It's me, Mrs. Gomez. Today in our writing mini lesson, we're actually going to be talking a lot about capital letters. In second grade, we've been really doing, we've been really doing a great job on capitalizing the beginning of a sentence. And I'm very proud of you for that. But in English, there's lots of things that we capitalize. And today we're going to talk about that. And we're going to talk about when to use these capital letters. Look at this. C-H-I-P-S. What does that spell? If you said chips, you're correct, boys and girls. It does spell chips. And that's just an acronym to help us remember when to use capital letters. The C stands for calendar words. The H stands for holiday words. The I stands for I by itself. The P stands for proper nouns, like people's names specific places and the names of pets and s stands for well we already know this in second grade sentences begin with a capital letter now remember c stands for calendar words such as days of the week like monday tuesday wednesday thursday friday saturday remember those days also months of the year are capitalized in english like january february march all of those months are capitalized holiday words are capitalized such as Easter and Christmas and I is capitalized by itself like this sentence my friend and I play ball I is capitalized no matter if it's in the beginning of a sentence in the middle of a sentence or at the end it's always capitalized in English and of course proper nouns like John and Nancy are, cap are capitalized places that are specific such as Tyler and Texas are capitalized and of course, pets like Parker and Rufus, those are capitalized. Now, the last letter, the S, we already know this in second grade. All sentences begin with capital letters, always. Like, the boy ran very fast, always begin with a capital letter. Okay, boys and girls, in second grade, we need to learn there are other things besides the beginning of a sentence that starts with capital letters. Calendar words, holiday words, I by itself, proper names, people, places, and pets, and, of course, the beginning of a sentence. Have a great day, boys and girls.